Hello everyone, and happy FF7 Remake Day. You held on to those Viziors for months. You even resisted Gummy throwing four summer waifus at us. But we made it, we persisted, and here is the day we've all been waiting for. Before I get started, I just want to shout out the remixes that Gummy has done on a lot of these videos. Uh, the Mako remix, the Final Fantasy X remix, and my favorite, which was the Nier. Uh, they're really cool, really great remixes, but let's get into it. Here is the strategy for the day. So generally the first thing I'll always do is check the drop rates. I've been burnt in the past with the Mont banner, and uh, I was just basically pulling at something where the rates were against me. You should always try and take a minute and just look at the drop rates to ensure that the rate is in your favor to get the unit or the vision card you're looking for. Obviously you have the 5 step banner which guarantees you the vision card, but I just want to go over to the uh, banner that I saw here which was uh, the 3 step banner uh, for the lightning. Here's a perfect example of pulling something and not getting rates that are really to your advantage in my opinion. So we're just going to scroll down here and then you see there's uh, 3 steps. On the 3rd step, I'm just going to scroll down. On the third step here, you see here that you have a guaranteed chance of getting your ultimate rare unit. Cloud is there, but Cloud is a 25% chance. The other three units aren't that great, especially if you get Shakal. Shakal is a horrible unit. So just things to consider. Same thing here with the Tifa Wind uh, pull. 25% chance of getting Tifa, which... Uh, which you get her for free, but then you would get the shards. You would probably be more interested in getting the shards. The reason why I definitely wouldn't pull any one of these, I have those units, and uh, a bit of an inside joke uh, with me and uh, my crew, the crew that I, I, I play with, I have horrible luck well, when it comes to uh, these shards. Sometimes uh, I get consistently get Yurma shards, and I get uh, Mashiri. I always get these like if I don't get what I'm looking for I usually get well, one or the other so uh, just something to keep in mind whenever you're looking to pull your your unit or you're looking to pull a unit just keep that in mind always try to pick or try to pull in your favor all right so here's the strategy I definitely need the FF7 vision card at Tower of Promise, so I'm going to need to keep at least 10k Vizior for that. However, I think I'm going to go with the 9 step, uh, and uh, I'll go through each step, and worst case, I'll readjust if I don't get Cloud by the 9 step. So um, let's do this. Heads up, I'm turning off the skip animation. We'll just hit it one by one, and uh, that's it. Wish me luck. All right, so uh, let's do this. Just a heads up, I'm not sure if people know this or not, either way, uh, the color of the book when opening up or when coming in tells you the rarity of the unit or the vision card that you're gonna get. So brown is bad, white is MR, and gold is UR. So keep that in mind. So far, from what I see, I'm gonna have a couple of MR cards, so fingers crossed. Of junk, murmur, eh. uni, oh, okay, MR, Lilith, and maybe this will change. Oh, uh, MR. Oh, all right, so nothing in the first one. Or nothing useful in the first one. There we go. Everything there. And they're giving stars. Oh, so, okay, so it's not that bad. Alright. So, next one. Step two. Ooh, brown is back. Okay, so... <laughs> <laughs> it's not starting well. Oof. All, all basic rarity. Nisha's useless. Phoebe. I should probably try and finish Phoebe. She has really good EX. Long-awaited 
holiday. The Honest Castle is actually a very underrated uh, card. It gives a 15 and 15, if I remember well. It's a good card. Keep that in mind. So, sha. Adelard. I think I have him finished. I don't think he's very good. Anyways. Uh, so, nothing. Uh, I guess Phoebe. And stars. And some other stuff. So, alright. So, we're on to step number three. Which is a free one. So, it's a freebie. Let's do this. Brown. Oh, man. Oh! Okay. Well, there you go. So, hey. Life. Lilo. Useless. Keep in mind of that card in class matches is extremely good. It gives 12% upgrade to the agility. So on a budget, it's a very good card. Oh, I got it twice. Wow. I got it three times. And Schultz. It's a pretty cruddy character. Even in the game, I don't really like him too much. He's a bit of a dumbass. Anyways, so um, let's go. Next one. Four. Step four. Fingers crossed. All right, gold. Let's let's see. A bit excited for this one. Snow White Guard. Sosha. Alright. Ugh! Rob. Jesus. Alright. Ugh. Rob. Jeez. Okay. Well, uh, let's go. Next step. Step number five. Ugh. And again. Okay. Alright, so... Crud. Crud. Jeez, I think I've seen that the, the shopping spree card like 10 times already. Anyways. Oh, that's not too bad. I haven't finished that one yet. Okay. Step number five. So, another freebie, number six. Let's uh, keep our fingers crossed. Oh, brown again. Okay, well, uh, you know. <laughs> Well, fingers crossed, maybe something will happen. So let's go through this. Another holiday. Jeez. She has a really good EX. She's a good EX character. Vadim. And what's the final one? Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, 
You serious? Wow. Okay. Hey, there you go. So step number six on the freebie. Um, wow. Very unexpected because, um, you know, brown sucked, brown bad, right? But um, there you go. Hey, sometimes you get lucky. And obviously they want to leave a review after they give me, uh, they gave me Cloud. So, um, I got Cloud step seven. I guess we're probably going to stop here. Maybe I'll go after uh, a Tower of Promise. Uh, I don't think there's any use in going forward. Uh, if anything, I'll probably come back, but let's go for a Tower of Promise. Maybe I can get lucky and get that before step number five, and I don't have to go through all 10k, but let's see. Alright, so brown. You know, brown is not too bad, so uh, let's see how this turns out. Lorenzo. Layard has a good EX, because then she gets Barrage, uh, and uh, you can kind of twin Barrage with um, with Frederica. What's this? Lilith. That's fine. Alright, so nothing so far. Let's head over to the next one. He is EXable, but I don't know if he's good. he has a good EX. Ugh. But, um, yeah, Lightning Slash, well, you know, Cloud is here, so I don't think I would need a second one. Probably not going to EX him. Oh, White Book, so there's an MR, guaranteed MR here. Alright, three MRs. Step number four is up next. Another thing that's really cool is I'm getting those hundred coins, which uh, if you look into the Mog Shop, you do have the ability to buy Cloud Shards. So just keep that in mind. It is a good thing. And another guaranteed MR as we move along on step four. Okay. So 
let's keep it moving. And the ultimate, so, you know, here I get the guaranteed uh, Tower of Promise. Um, you know, so there you go, I've got the, the card. Oh, and let's see. Uh, oh, okay, cool. And then I get a UR. So let's see who I get. So I guess this is going to be the card. Yeah, there you go. So there's a card, a Tower of Promise. Alright, reset. Another long awaited holiday. Palaid. The Muraga. Muraga meat or Muraga. Anyhow. <laughs> and Sleepy. That's Riel. So, I already have her in full. Uh, if anything, it's for the rainbow. The rainbow. Um, Rainbow Orb, which is pretty good. And, uh, there you go. Uh, hey, why not? Let's do the, um, let's do the free one here. Can I do the... No, it's fine. Oh, yes, and I have to do the 75 or the 25 million. Either way, um, let's do... I have 10 tickets. Let's go through and uh, get rid of some of these tickets. I have 10 left. Well, let's shoot that off. Yeah. Usually for these ones, brown is, is not good. So I don't really expect anything good from this. <laughs> and it starts well. Continues. Fadim, like the tenth time. <laughs> Valet. And the ultimate is uh, Naya. She's not that great. So there you have it. Yeah. So just just to point out, um, yeah. You see here. So the soul soul stars. So you have the ability to, to pick up some cloud shards. And so there you go. And the vision card. You'll be able to pick that up too. There you go. So it'll help you really speed through and max out those cards. I still haven't finished that uh, Omega, but um, I'm probably going to use it most on that. And then obviously with all the uh, MR shards, really helps put up the Soul Spears and your Soul Medals so that you're going to be able to go through. Let me just do this quick while I'm here. By the 10. There you go. Okay. So, um, there you go. So, I managed to get Cloud. Really happy about that. I got it off a of brown book, too, which is uh, pretty crazy. And, yeah. So, I'm really excited. Uh, I'm gonna start building him, start going into building him up. Quickly get him to the character quest, which will power him up even further. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching the video. Uh, this is my first pull video where I'm kind of going through pulls. Uh, if you like it, if you really enjoy it, um, give it a like, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks!